Hey team, nice to see you. Welcome back. Let's talk about depression. Depression in the workplace, in my workplace in particular. So it's been a while since I did a video and a few things have happened since then. I came out at work. Yay! I'm gay. Gay means happy. Wrong coming out. I sort of depression came out, which sounds like the worst kind of coming out ever. So let me explain. I reached critical mass up here and I had a kind of a breakdown. I had to open up to my manager about what had happened um, and what was happening and how I had been feeling for over almost a year now. Um, and she kind of forced me to go to the GP. When I say forced, she did it ever so lovingly and politely and kindly, I will add. Anyone who suffers from a depressive disorder knows that going to the doctor is the hardest thing that you never want to do. If you have never suffered from a depressive disorder, I can promise you that that is the fucking hardest thing ever. Ever. So, she sent me off to the GP and off I went, uh, almost not going there. I didn't want to get there. But people say the devil shies away when you name him, so I got there. Which I am thankful for now, but at the time it's something that I wanted to avoid. But it turns out that I fucking needed to do it because I was losing my lust for life. In fact, I already had kind of lost the desire for life, to be honest with you. But back to talking about depression at work or in my workplace. Um, and I know that a lot of people don't have a great experience with it at work and because there's a whole lot of stigma and ignorance around it, um, not everyone is as lucky as I was. But I have to say that the support and positivity that I've experienced is absolutely phenomenal. I was nervous, embarrassed, I was anxious about what my friends would say, about what my boss would say, about how everyone was going to react about the situation. I know now that I had absolutely nothing to worry about whatsoever. Uh, I have the support and love to get through it as well and now I think that I might. No, I'm not better, but I'm in a much better place. At least now, when I have these thoughts, I can think it through. They don't just overtake and overwhelm me. And the best of all thing, really, is that now I get to use my pain, uh, my suffering, and my experience to try and help others within my business. I'm working to make sure that my whole organization looks at mental illness a lot seriously and that they're informed about what having a mental illness means and how we can work with people going forward. And I've been in talks with various, I guess, higher-ups uh, in terms of starting some great initiatives and I'll be sure to let you know how that goes. I'm going to do another video very soon with some tips uh, in terms of how to survive in the workplace uh, for you, especially for those who suffer from depressive disorders. But for the meantime, this is my story. Thank you for watching. I love your support. Uh, leave a like if you found this helpful. Subscribe if you need these tips or if you just want to see what else goes on. I'd love to hear your stories as well and I will see you very, very soon.